Hello, welcome to Life in Pig Row on a Bull Street autumn day, and today we're looking at picking Alexander seeds. This is Alexander. Now, Alexander, for those of you who don't know, is an alternative to pepper, and these are the peppercorns on the Alexander, or oh, the seed to be more accurate, that tastes a mix like pepper and cumin. And it's really easy to pick them, it's just a matter of taking them off and putting them in the cup that we have here. So Alexanders are biennials and they look a lot like cow parsley when they're growing. So in the first year they put on a lot of green growth and in the second year they flower and it's a beautiful flower as well. And then they turn obviously to seed which is what we're collecting now, which looks like this. Now I'm collecting seed for two reasons. One, because I want to grow more next year and know that this plant is finished because it's biannual. And also I'm collecting it because I want an alternative to pepper. As I said, it tastes a bit like pepper crossed with cumin, which is really good in flatbreads. Let's go and have a look how we dry it. So it's really simple. On a south facing windowsill, we lay it out on a metal tray. And you can hear it now, it's completely dry. But how do you turn it? into pepper. Let's go and look at that. So as you can see, here's our Alexanders in the bowl. Make sure when you collect them you don't pick up lots of little baby snails. They seem to have a bit of a fondness for them. You don't want to be grinding baby snails, hence that's why we put them under the windowsill for a few weeks, so facing, and that way we can pick out any baby snails that make a break for it. And it's just like pepper, mortar, pestle. That's what it goes into, just like pepper. So I've come indoors now because it's got a bit more blustery out there. Um, so as you can see, you can grow your own pepper. It tastes like a mixture of pepper and cumin, which is really nice, really, really nice. Uh, if you enjoy what we do, like and subscribe to Life and Pick Row. Until next time, bye bye.